Morning everyone. About to start filming for uh, another episode of the vlog. And I got my right hand man with me today, Mr. Lennox. He's currently ill. Uh, so we just go after wing it and record on the camera. But to be fair, the good thing is with all these new iPhones, they all shoot on like 4K anyway. So it's not even too bad. But yeah, we've got a couple haircuts to do today. A couple surprise guests coming through, so be exciting to keep up to date. Mate, awful. Uh, awful. Can you, I'm bare bummed up yet. Yeah, your eyes look heavy to be fair. Yeah, they are. You're coming. I need to jump in the shower quick time. Alright, cool. Well, it'll take me about 15 minutes to get to you anyway. So if I drive up to you, we'll go office, grab the camera. I'll phone Greg. Um, and then we'll push yeah. right away. We're going to get some breakfast on the way. That's calm, that's calm, that's calm. Let's change your plan. Brad's coming now. So that's good. So at least I got my videographer for the day. So let's try to answer these messages. Because when you sleep during the night, your fucking phone blows up. Okay. So I'm going to go and grab Brad now. Um, we're going to go and cut Greg Piper's hair, who played um, Ryan Pilkington in Line of Duty. Um, yeah, sorry, Brad's just texting me. Okay, we've got to run it errand. We've got to go and grab all his kit. Um, yeah, got to go cut Greg Piper's hair, who played Ryan Pilkington in Line of Duty. So if you haven't seen Line of Duty Series 6, it was definitely worth a watch. It was great. And Ryan played an absolutely fantastic character. Um, so got to go cut his hair, and then i got to go and meet with the uh, MP of Bromsgrove. Mr. Kyle Daisley, we've got a few things to talk about in terms of like a future event that we're trying to get together. Um, whether we can talk about that and release a few things in the video, that's we'll see when we record the video. Um, but yeah, that's the day for today. So just on the way to go and get Brad now, and then he'll take over from the video. So you're just on the way now to go and put Greg's hair. Uh, we're going to go and do it at his girlfriend's house. Um, just put it up now. Just set the house right now. So I think this is the one. I don't know the house is. Uh, I think it might be this one. I don't even know where we're going. <laughs> I think it's this one. I want to say this one. Yeah, yeah, it is. Hey, Greg, you okay? Mask on. That's okay. Yeah, that's fine. All right, Brad, this is Greg. Greg, this is Brad. How's it going? How's it going? How's it going? How's it going? Okay. Good. You're on my Good to see you, man. So, what have you been doing in the meantime since Lime Duty finished? Um, a lot of his workshop, yeah. Okay, cool. So, trying to launch that and change like update websites and stuff like that you know what was the first thing you did like what was the first like that you can remember the first thing that you thought this is getting serious now was um, it the theatres with, when we used both with the company both or like uh, a bit of both like in acting i suppose so i remember you both saying like you, you used to do the theatres and the play yeah 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 it? well i was like insanely lucky about getting line of duty so early i was 13 when i got that and that wasn't too long when I was at uh, workshop, really. And then that's kind of what spurred on workshop because of all of like being in the paper and stuff like that. Yeah. So I was I was exposed to an amazing opportunity really early on. But then in between Line of Duty series one and then me being in series five again, there's obviously a big gap. So then through the college, yeah, we got involved in a lot of theatre through the Fizogs, so they're a local theatre group, and they do a lot of comedy. So it was um, teaming up with them and doing a lot of theatre, so theatre bridged the gap, really. Telling you about that festival thing, like last year, that we wanted to do, but Covid hit. Yes, yeah. Uh, I'll go meet the one of the councillors later on. Oh, yeah? Yeah, but I'll quickly say later, uh, I'm going to speak about that, and then I'll go meet another one Tuesday. Yeah. Um, so hopefully we can get like the National Lottery back on board as well. That's cool. What's that again then? Who that was you? like a like a music festival. That was. Yes. Like, yeah. Um, kind of like a wireless but local. Yeah. We never really have anything happen over here, do we? No, 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 no. It's no. all over in London or closest towards Digbeth. If any events gone. Yes. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. So uh, 
Obviously, with all the small businesses and everything, everyone being affected by COVID. Yeah. If we set up little tents or little like food stores or something, yeah. They could pay us X amount, let's say like hundred pound for easy yeah. numbers. Yeah. Whatever they make on top they keep. So yeah. they can start back for, from COVID and Yeah, yeah, yeah. That so, sounds sick. Yeah, yeah. Hope, trust me, hopefully. But obviously now that summer's probably done now, ain't it? Yeah. About that week or so. <laughs> I know. So it might, it might not be able to happen this year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no. Aren't the major events as well cancelled for this year again? Uh, I think so, but I don't know if wireless and that are going on. I haven't really looked into it too much. Yeah, they are. They're going on. The board cancelled. Is that got cancelled? No. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, or they're on about cancelling it, but I know when um, Notting Hill or whatever it is. You know, oh, yeah, the carnival that's been cancelled, ain't it? Yeah. Until next year, no. Okay, so we just finished doing Greg's hair now. This is Greg from uh, series six of Line of Duty. If you haven't seen it, you can watch it on BBC iPlayer. Great series, great character. Um, he's got a new project underway at the moment with a workshop. Uh, he'll tell you a little bit more now where to find it. Yeah, so it's a workshop in Stourbridge uh, from six to 18. There's also an adult class as well. Uh, so yeah, so it's in Stourbridge um, Drama Workshop by the Stourbridge Junction and the links will all be below so how you can find it. Perfect, so that's all wrapped up. Great to see you again. Thanks, man. No Cheers. problem. I'll see you soon. Appreciate it. See you later. Yes, YouTube. So, just wrapped up a uh, freestyle for the artist from Wolverhampton called Little Ben. And that one's going to drop on his own, free, um, his own YouTube channel. The backdrop looks absolutely crazy. Um, we're just now on the way to go and do a, another little freestyle for Sarge. Um, so, just on the way to his house now. And then he's coming home, isn't it? Mate, it is coming home. I'm telling you, it's coming home. It's 3-0 England. <laughs> That's more friction. You reckon? 100%. 100% Fuck it up, sorry Definitely son, definitely Yeah, well, go do that freestyle I've uh, done another one To be fair, the smoke in the room is really sat on my chest now, so. so I hit my chest a little bit But it was worth it because the freestyle was class The song was hard uh, We'll do this next one now And then that'll be a wrap for today And then we'll go back home, we'll watch it more. And then we'll just chill for the rest of the week And then back to it again from tomorrow <laughs> Yo, sometimes I kick back and hold a vibe Other days I blaze the star dog trying to ease your summer mind And life shit, but what are you doing with your time? Maybe you're going legit, my nigga, or you're doing crime Cause there ain't no in between in these streets Can't trust in everybody, watch the company you keep Gotta keep at least one eye open when you sleep Make sure you got the other on your peas and your hand up on your heat Cause these roads cold, colder than a twist on a summer's day I get chills anytime I'm visiting my mother's grave Falling out with people each and every other day Cause the arts, God remove the people who are fucking fake I was a winners either way, we make it through the pain Charge it to the game, we make it back again another way Run it up and double back, we do it all again Thinking it's a game like EA, but then you're fucking strange Part there ain't no games up inside that can All you do is strategize and figure out to be a man Figure out the bigger plan and how you get into the bag You see the system's all fucked when you get out, they want you back And me, I stay up on my jacks, that's true, I only trust my shadow Broski told me, yo, you moving paro I've been having mad dreams, running up and putting one up in his marrow These days, man, I sleep, he like hollow uh, I'm still grieving in my thoughts because I'm vexed I they talking on my nigga like I won't blow out your chest Bet I'll put your dog in check cause they calling me a vet Put your dog in them to rest because their facts are incorrect Smoking all this weed trying to deal with all my stresses Still I got something that needs addressing I've been on this road teaching all these kids this lesson Thanks for to the Lord cause he just showers me with blessings Bow